It's like rosemary potato. That's pretty good. Was that worth $22? <laughs> Nothing's worth $22. <laughs> Look at this spot. I was starving. Good. That red copy. Nope, I just got done telling you I was really tired. This was something different. This was something different. I liked it. Yeah. We're off to uh, wash our car and find you a bathroom. What are you looking? What are you looking? That Forester that has all train tires on it. Ooh. You're not a boy. You don't get it. Well, I enjoyed that. Thanks for bringing me. Yeah, that was fun. <laughs> so since it's springtime, I've been getting the urge to like purge and to clean my stuff out. So I'm just creating a bag right now of stuff to donate and stuff to throw out. I just feel like things are starting to like have little piles instead of having everything have a place, which is like driving me freaking crazy. Um, we hiked to the Grand Canyon last week, so it's been a whole week now. It was last Friday and today's Saturday, so it's been eight days. And like, I still have like different stuff going on with my body from that. Like my nose, I, every time I blow my nose, there's still blood just from like the elevation loss and then gain. And then I have like dry skin all around my mouth still and what else oh I burned my freaking eyes so I don't know if you guys can see this but like I don't know I think I need to go to the doctor like see a specialist see the ophthalmologist but both of my eyes like my contacts dry out so fast and like by like three o'clock four o'clock I feel like I can't even see well enough to drive because my contacts are being so dried out by whatever the heck I did to my eyes so I'm just like blinking and I have to take them out and put on my glasses and it's become a real problem um and that happened before we hiked actually that hiked. I haven't done the drive out there so I'm feeling a little bit concerned about that honestly okay I just found some shoes in the back of my closet with mold on them so I'm not sure what to do I'm googling and it seems like I need to throw them out um but I don't want to I feel like that's really wasteful but look at all of that reddit says that the spores are gonna spread so I did end up having to chuck those shoes, which I'm really sad about. Um, but I was just reading about it, and I guess in places with high humidity, you need to have some airflow into your closet, which I've never really thought about before. Um, so we live in San Diego and in, in an area of San Diego that's on the water. So it's like not uncommon for us. I mean, most of the time it's like 70% humidity, 80% humidity, 90% humidity. <laughs> like that's, that's our daily norm. So like we do deal with a lot of humidity related issues like inside of our house. That's just a new one that I hadn't, I hadn't come across before. So I'm going to be looking out for that now and maybe leaving my closet door open sometimes. Um, but yeah, I think Kevin fell asleep, so he's taking a nap, and I just got hungry. I didn't eat a full lunch, I just had that smoothie, so I'm gonna go fix myself something and take a break from all of this. I just started Googling what the heck I did to my eyes, and now I'm getting kind of scared. It says I might have, like, done this, that, the third thing, and here's what's going on, and I'm like, ah! And then I was scrolling over here too. Um, and then I read the word tumor might be developing. And I don't like the sound of that. <laughs> Kevin got some burn from the farmer's market. Oh, honey. How was your nap? It was good. You're supposed to say glorious. Glorious. <laughs> yeah. 
still kind of waking up. But he wants to watch The Chosen. Yeah, it's making me feel good inside. Oh, let's go, Jesus. <laughs> I already ate my leftovers from last night, but I'm still very hungry. So I'm making a bagel with egg salad. <laughs> La Croix. So that break ended up not being a break. It ended up being me being done. So it's been like two and a half hours now. I ate a couple times. I hung out with Kevin. Um, but yeah, no, I, I left myself a bit of a mess that we are leaving here in about 30 minutes to go mini golf with friends. So I have, I kind of need to clean up because I kind of pulled a lot out. Um, but I'm, I'm pretty happy with myself. Like we, I got out two trash bags. So one's filled with trash and one is filled with like donations for the Goodwill. And yeah, they're both full. So yeah, feeling good. <laughs> Your hair looks cool. Thanks. Very 90s. I appreciate it. <laughs> okay. Dinner, I have a little doggy bag. No shop with me. Yeah, I did see. <laughs> <laughs> I saw somebody shoplift, which yeah, I didn't like. So bad. I was going to just come on here and say that I am against shoplifting. I'll just, I'm sorry to disappoint any of you. But that's. What about phantom taxing? She's not like, shut up. <laughs> So yeah, thanks for coming with me on my day. And Katie, there's a curb. Watch out, don't fall. Don't I'm watching sit. out. I'm not falling. I'm not tripping. Um, any last words? Peace out, Girl Scouts. I love you. I don't know if I love you. Okay, bye. <laughs>